Welcome back to a new episode here in Suave. In today's episode, I'm gonna show you how you can make a cool like website scroll animation effect. I don't know if it's called an effect, but let's call it that way. But anyway, so this is what it looks like. Okay, so the first thing that you're gonna need is, um, okay, let's hop into the screen and I'm gonna show you what you're gonna do first. The first thing that you need is you're going to go to your page. We're going to use the Theia Transitions page here in this case. And we are going to use these tool or this plugin on Google Chrome that's called Go Full Page Full Page Screen Capture, I think it is. After you install that, you're going to see this puzzle here and then you can click here and that's going to take a full picture of your page and then it's gonna show up like this and then you can simply just click here and download that as a png file and then you can we are gonna use that file in davinci resolve to do what we want to do okay so now that we have that we're gonna go into davinci resolve and i'm gonna show you what you have to do i'm gonna show you the easy one of the ways that you can do it maybe the easiest way and the way that it takes the lowest or lightest uh, on your system because there's many ways you can do a 3d way 2d infusion but this one is like a mix so yeah let's just jump into the screen again and i'm gonna show you that step and i'll see you at the end of the video okay so now that you have these what you want to do is you want to render this so we're gonna go here and we're gonna render and save it as a video So then when you render it, you want to import it back into your project as a video. The reason for this is that this way it takes less of a tool on your computer since it doesn't have to process everything again, right? So we have our video right here and we don't need this image anymore. We can just deactivate it for now. We're going to right click these and we're going to open this in the Fusion page. And in this page, what we can do is we can add the, the what do you call that, the, the border. We can add that border that was a solid border, which is the background. We're going to go right here, add it here. Uh, and then we're going to add a square mask. And then we're going to go here and with, make one and then one. We're going to take the solid out and then we can increase the border width. Now we can see it right here already. Then we can add, change the color. You can make it one color. Or you can make it like a gradient like i did in the first video that you saw and you can animate that and all that you want so this is what it looks like at the end what you have and you have that screen already moving and all that stuff so then here and once you bring it back you can adjust the jaw or the page whatever you like in the zoom you can make it smaller so you can insert it somewhere so then once you have your page then you can just basically add it to on top of any video or you can just leave it like that as it is um, and you you can just be as creative as you want as always as I always say so that is pretty much how you would go about doing as like website scroll animation you can do this to showcase a product page or like a bunch of products if you have like an e-commerce store you can use these for that too or if you have a presentation uh, you can use these in any many ways you can just be as creative as you want as I always say and yeah so if you need a also uh, check you can check the link down below i started a web like sign business a, a while ago a couple of months back uh, so if you need a website you can also check that link down below and yeah i hope that you enjoyed this video and if you find it helpful let me know down in the comments below and if you do have any other requests or any ideas or content that you want me to make or figure out like an after effects video or something um just let me know down in the comments you can link it down below and yeah that is pretty much it so i hope that you enjoyed this video and also let me know if you like this format do you want me to be on screen or do you just prefer me to be off screen i i don't really mind uh, it's okay if you just wanted me to use this screen recording um uh, but yeah so let me know down in the comments and i hope to see you in the next episode here in suave bye